Howdy Zone Stars, I'm back. So I do want to address a couple of things real quick before we jump into this video. There will be a video coming very soon where we go into details about the channel suspension, the things I found out, and answers to some of your questions, as well as thank yous to everybody that went above and beyond to try to help me to get the channel back. That is coming. It's just that unfortunately I got the channel back while I was in Vegas. So that just kind of made everything a little bit complicated, you guys, but that will be coming soon. So I know some of you guys have questions. We will answer those questions for you. However, I did want to really briefly though, um, on my return, I, I wanted to address something very near and dear to my heart. As you guys know, I am from Texas. I am Texan Candy and Right now, Texas is going through a really, really difficult time, you guys. We got hit with Hurricane Harvey on our coast. Um, you know, Corpus Christi was mostly spared, but um, Port Aransas, Rockport, Texas, little beach towns along the coast did not get so lucky. There's, you know, quite a bit of impact there. But I think largely the major impacts were not when Hurricane Harvey hit landfall but rather the after effects of all of the rain and houston and the houston surrounding areas you guys are for the most part underwater there are people that are being rescued from the rooftops of their home um there's already a report of one family that got swept away in the rain and it is believed that almost everybody drowned including some children i mean just devastating things people have been in shelters and had to leave. People lost everything. Some people left with just the clothes on their back. You guys, it's it's such a heartbreaking situation. I can't even begin to tell you. I actually ended up staying in Vegas a little long because of the threat of Hurricane Harvey. The night that I was supposed to fly in is the day that the threats really got kind of serious and at that point we thought san antonio was going to be impacted and just weren't prepared to deal with all of that um to fly into that to fly home to a home that was unprepared for it we had no supplies here we knew nothing about it when i left for vegas so you know those thoughts the the terrifying situation that you're faced with but you know you can't even begin to imagine what people are going through you guys so please if you are a person that prays, please pray for Texas. But I think, you know, our prayers are great and they lift people up. But right now we need to do more than just pray, you guys. We need to help our fellow brothers and sisters. We need to help our fellow Texans if you're from Texas. Please do what you can to help. If you are in a position to visit Houston and help with relief efforts, please do so. If you're not able to do that but you have some money, any amount of money helps. Please donate through the Red Cross. The Red Cross is trying to help people impacted. If it's not the Red Cross and there's another charity organization that you believe in, that you know your money is going to be well spent, do that. Just do what you can. It's it's devastating the thing that the things that are happening right now in Texas and the impacts that are being felt by people. I can't even begin to imagine, you guys. So I did just want to quickly touch base on that. Um, you know, I'm happy to be home. I'm happy to have the channel and, and all of those things, but it is very bittersweet. It comes at a very difficult time for anyone who is native to this place or even America for that matter, or even a human being. But please, I encourage all of you, donate to the Red Cross. Do whatever you can to help out fellow Texans. It would be much appreciated for me as well as anyone who is currently a victim of that. Our friend A.R. Platinum is from the Houston area. Luckily, he was largely spared for now. You know, there it, it appears that him and his family are fine. They're dealing with a lot of rain and water, but for the most part, they're fine. They haven't, you know, they didn't have to leave their home. It's not underwater or anything like that, but not everyone is so lucky. So you guys, please pray for Texas. And if you can afford to, please make a donation through the Red Cross or through an organization of your choosing, but please do what you can to help those that need it most right now. It only seems fitting that we scratch some Texas tickets on the return to Texas and on this video dedicated to our fellow Texans. So we're gonna go ahead and start with this $5 Houston Texans ticket, and then also picked up a $5 Cowboys ticket. These are brand new, first time I'm scratching them as a whole, and definitely the first time I'm scratching them on the channel because I didn't have the channel when they came out. Haven't scratched many tickets for you guys. There's going to be quite a bit. That's what happens when you're out for three weeks and can't put up any content. Things happen and then suddenly you're way behind. So 
we'll work on doing that. On this ticket, we're just trying to match the winning number, or I think there's some symbols we want to look for. Yep, football is an auto win. Goalpost is five times. And there's a second chance prize on this, which is kind of cool. Personally, I don't do football games. I don't have a favorite football team, but be nice to win some swag. All right, nothing yet. And I'm sure you'll be seeing many more of these tickets. All right, no love there. Now we're gonna go ahead and do our Cowboys ticket. Same premise here, we're looking to match the winning numbers or football or touchdown symbol. Touchdown symbol is a win all on this ticket though. I do like that they cut it out. It's not a you know, traditional square ticket. It's shaped like a football and I thought that was kind of, kind of creative. Also, there's a second chance on this one too. We'll tell you the Texans ticket definitely scratches much better than the Dallas ticket. Excuse us, Peppy. Peppy loves us and we love him and he's excited we're back but he won't stop getting in front of the camera. All right, let's see if we can match one of these numbers or find ourselves a symbol that would be even sweeter. But I did just buy two of them, so odds are not great for a win, but all it takes is one ticket, you guys. Wow, this is a rough ticket to scratch, I'll tell you what. All right, we're down to the last row. Could we find some last row love. Nope, I've had some crappy luck lately and it just continues. All right, that's okay. That is A-OK, -okay. that's the lottery for you. Thank you guys for watching. Once again, please pray for Texas. Please donate through the Red Cross. Help your brothers and sisters that need it most right now out of Texas. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. If you're not subscribed, please hit the subscribe button. Don't forget to like this video. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.